Hello everyone. In this demo, we will create resource group Azure OpenAI service and we will deploy the OpenAI model. So let's log in into the Azure portal. First of all, we will create the resource group. Resource group is the logical container that holds related resources of Azure solution. So we have to click on this resource group icon. Click on create. give the resource group name i have given res resource group name rg123 we can choose the location here i will select here something else let's go with the east us only now click on create resource group get created now we can see the our resource group rg123 here need to click on this one now in the next step we will create the azure open ai service to create the azure open ai service we, we will create on click on this create button and here we will search, search azure open ai this is the azure open ai service click on this icon then this and then click on this create button to create azure open ai service azure open ai open ai is a service provided by microsoft that allow users to access powerful large language model developed by open ai such as gpt3 gpt4 here we have to add the details so I, I will be creating this azure open ai service in resource group rg123 location here is east us but i will select east us2 and here we have to give the name let's check whether this name is available or not okay so we can use this name then select the pricing tier i'm using the trial version that's why it is showing a standard as zero now click on next let's go with the default selected option now it's creating the Azure Open AI service. It will seek, it will take some time. Azure Open AI service deployment is in not deployment complete. So click on go to resource. Now we have to click on the on the Azure Open AI Studio on this icon to access the Azure Open AI Studio. Now we can see the Azure Open AI Studio browser. Uh, from this browser, we can we, we can deploy the different models and we can access it. Okay, so there is a multiple option available. As of now, we have to focus on the deployment. So I will create to deploy the model. We will click on this one deployments. Now we have two option. We have option to create a deployment. So click on create new deployment. Give the deployment name. I'm giving the deployment name model one from the drop down select model i will use i will use gpt 40 this is the model version and deployment type okay now click on create deployment done now now we can see deployment name model name and model version these details are important when we want to access or we want to develop any application and uh, if you want to use this model, then you need the deployment name, model name, and model version. So click on this model. Here uh, we, we are getting an option open in playground. So this is very good option to check our deployment and, uh, and to try something. So let's click on open in playground. Now we have multiple options available. So first of all, we need to check two things, chat and completions. So there are two ways to interact with large language model, chat and, com and completion. In the completion, we provide the text and it's generated the next text. But in chat option, uh, it is designed for conversational in interaction 
model remember the context of previous exchange and can provide the response based on on that on ongoing conversation okay so these are the two two different options available to interact with the models here various option is available but uh, let's try with couple of portion and with check whether our model is working or not so here i just tapped hi and we get the response from the model let's try with very simple question from the llm that the capital of india is new delhi let's ask another question now we are asking the an another question now we can see model has generated the answer and we can we can see the response from the model here so basically our model is working fine let's click on this view code from this screen we can get the endpoint api key and sim simple code we can use these details to to create python code for our custom solution we will see how to create the custom solution using the python code in the next demo thank you so much guys